this is Pastor Phil Vickers. Bring a reading this morning from the prophet Hosea in chapter 6, verse 1 and following. It says, Come, let us return to the Lord, for it is he who has torn, and he will heal us. He has struck down, and he will bind us up. After two days he will revive us. On the third day he will raise us up, that we may live before him. Let us know, let us press on to know the Lord. His appearing is as sure as the dawn. He will come to us like the showers, like the spring rains that water the earth. Two beautiful analogies there from nature. Uh, just as we can be certain of the sun's rising in the morning, just as we can be certain of the spring rains, we can be certain that uh, God will fulfill God's promises. But even in that time of waiting, notice what Hosea encourages. Uh, it is a return to the Lord. Uh, it is uh, to press on to know the Lord. So as we wait upon God to act, especially in these times as we wait for our political processes to be settled, as we wait for pandemics to end and life to return to normal, uh, we don't wait passively, but rather actively and busily uh, in returning to the Lord through repentance, uh, through prayer, and in pressing on to know the Lord. That is what we are called to be engaged in, even as we wait upon um, God to do those things which God promises to do. May you find hope and joy and expectation in your waiting, and may you turn to the Lord, and may you, uh, uh, may you press on to know the Lord uh, in these times and find joy in that. In Jesus' name.